The next option is to contact the congressman representing your district. Now, when you hear the word congressman, you might be thinking, heck, I'm not a U.S. citizen. How am I supposed to contact the congressman? But what you need to understand is that a congressman is there to represent everyone who lives in your district, be that foreign nationals or U.S. citizens. Now, generally, when you contact the office of your congressman, you're going to be asking them to help you speed up your case with USCIS. Given that USCIS is a U.S. federal agency that falls under the direct oversight of Congress, your congressman has a lot of leverage to get USCIS to take action on your case. In many cases, the process of contacting your congressman to help speed up your case with USCIS could be as easy as visiting your congressman's website. Let's take a look at some examples of how to do this. The first thing you want to do is to determine the congressman who represents your district. To do that, you want to go to this website at www.govtrack.us. The link to this website can be found in the description section below. On the home page of this website, you want to click on Legislators and select Members of Congress. And on this web page, under Find Your Representatives and Senators, you just want to enter your current address or your zip code. And in this search result, we can find the member of Congress representing our district, and we simply visit his official website. On this website, we want to navigate to Services, and then we click on Help with the Federal Agency. And on this web page, we can find detailed instructions to follow in order to get help with the federal agency from this office. And in the case of this office, all you have to do is to complete this online authorization form. And once you're done, you want to print this out, then sign it and mail or fax it to his office. For the second example, let's try a city in California. Once again, in the search results, we can find a member of Congress representing a district. We go to his official website. And on this website, we can navigate to services and click on help with federal agencies. And once again, we can see the protocol to follow to get help with the federal agency using this office. And in the case of this office, all you have to do is to complete and sign this consent form and then scan and email the form to the email address located at the top. And there you have it. These are the most effective ways that I've found to speed up your case with USCIS. If you have any questions or concerns about this topic, please leave me a comment in the comment section below. Make sure to share this video with someone you know who is experiencing delays with USCIS. If you found this video very helpful, give this a like and also subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with similar high value content coming your way. Thank you for watching the video and I'll catch you on the next one.